guys, it's Susie and welcome to day eight of our intentional resolution planning for New Year's. And yesterday I talked about avoiding regret and that was prompted by a very specific circumstance uh, that presented itself yesterday. And I want you to look back to uh, the first day that we had your journal, okay? And you wrote down a list of your as of yet unfulfilled goals, okay? I want you to look at each one individually. I want you to think about who is it that actually set that goal for you? Was it was it you because it's a self-development and personal growth goal or because maybe it'll boost your career and that full, that makes it something that you really, really want to do? I mean, that that's motivation, right? Or if would you look at it and think about it, is it really something that somebody else told you that you had to or you should do okay chances are when you look at each of these in turn and you gut check on each one of them possibly half or more may instantly jump out and you realize that their rats really somebody else's goal that was set for me it's their wish being pushed on me okay you know circle the ones that are legitimately yours cross out the ones that are not and start a new page okay number one put the one that you're focused on mainly for uh, for December coming up. And now add just the legitimate ones from before. Maybe they were failure to launch in the past, but you know, you add them to the list. So it's a to-do list in other words. What this does is it gets a lot of weight off of your shoulders, okay? Um, don't judge yourself as a failure or a loser because you didn't do a thing from the past. When you look at those things and you realize that was somebody else's plan for you, pfft, Kick that to the curb, all right? You don't need that. Feeling like you have to jump through a hoop that you are not thrilled of, that's gonna take a ton of energy away from the thing that you really do want to pursue. So I want you to give that some thought. Spend time in your happy place tonight. Think about these things and I'll talk to you tomorrow.